This is a 1991 Toyota Soar, which is not in the U.S. This was exported from Japan. Uh, this, of course, the steering is going to be on the right-hand side instead of the left, uh, which was a little bit of a challenge because we're used to bending towards the right uh, within the past 30 years, and now we have to bend towards the left. I guess it kind of fixed my back a little bit, but... Uh, at the end of the day it was a little tough because if you right handed it makes the installation a little tougher to get to uh, make the connections even though the car is easy to do. I'm going to go ahead and lock the doors. I'm going to go ahead and hit arm, locks the doors, disarm it, you're going to hit unlock, unlocks the door, it gives you four chirps because that means the alarm went off. We gave them the trunk release, if you hold the trunk button down, it pops the trunk, okay. Uh, just got started kill so if somebody breaks in and they turn the key in the ignition the car won't start uh, he's got the, the Viper smart start with the text alert uh, so basically uh, if the alarm fires off he'll get a text message to his phone uh, it's got the shock sensor for the windows it comes with two remote controls uh, I'm gonna go ahead and fire off the alarm shut off the alarm it does have a panic button the star here is a panic button and you can fire off the system this car is very cool uh, the alert came in you probably hear the phone making the little wing 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 noise there's that the alarm was triggered by a uh, shock sensor it's kind of hard to see on the uh, actual phone because of the Sun out here but it gave him the little siren and, the, and it'll also send them a text and you can program it to get an email it takes about maybe 10 15 20 seconds sometimes it all depends how backed up the servers are for you to get your alert uh this alarm was installed here in miami florida by auto alarm specialists on this uh japanese import thank you for watching this video